well guys, it's busy. Um, yeah, so I just finished uh, seeing my psychiatrist, Adam Roller. He's a good guy. He's a physician assistant. But basically, um, I have EPS, which is like extrapyramidal syndrome, something like that. It's not tardive dyskinesia. So um, basically, uh, that's why I do things I do with my hands, like twitching my hands and like making weird faces, sticking on my tongue, stuff like that. But I have to do more research about it. But um, yeah, they put me on one milligram of antihypertensive. That's like 180 milligrams, and my thiopine that's 160 milligrams. Yeah, so I have to take that every night. Hopefully, it helps combat the side effects of uh, psychiatric medication. Um, one thing about psychiatric med medication, like it makes you level, but like, I still get happy, but uh, and I don't get manic or depressive anymore, which is good. But my level is like very blase. Like I'm a fun person and I'm a good person. It's just that um, with mental illness and medication, when you're on medication, it kind of dulls you out. Yeah, so I'm still fun and. Uh, Still a fun loving cool chick. I just um I just have like a level headedness now. I'm not as hyper as I used to be before the medication. Uh, I was ADHD since I was what first grade. I had ADHD. I still have it, but it's dulled down now that I'm psych meds, I'm not as hyperactive. Uh yeah, I also have dyslexia, so there's that too. But, um, yeah, so I have EPS or whatever the heck, what is it? I don't know what it's called. I don't know. I'll, I'll put the name over here. But, yeah, so psych, uh, psych, uh, psychiatric, whatever, evaluation was good. And, like, my three-month update, a uh, three-month visit check was good. But, yeah, that's pretty much what I found out I have. I just got to take one milligram of cogentin at night before I go to bed with food. But sometimes I don't take it with food. But it still works. But I think I'll start taking it with food so it works better. But yeah. Um, talk to you guys later. Uh, art perpetuates art. Love perpetuates love. Let the love be and be love. Peace out, guys.